I'm going to start off by showing you all the sale things that I got. And so I love collecting washi tape. It's so easy to put in place on cards or scrapbook pages or even on my planner. And so I thought those were a really good deal. One was $149 and one was $119 and I thought that was so cute just for fun, positive things like the emoji one and then the little foxes. It's so cute with the mint. Okay, so the first I'm going to show you is all the stuff that was on sale at Hobby Lobby. Then, this little, these two stickers here, I'm sorry about the glare. Um, I'm still doing some scrapbooking from Florida, so I thought I would be able to use the Florida stickers there, and those were only 53 cents. And then, you know, I love cherries and Mary Inglebright, and I thought, look at all those cherries, how cute is that? And that was only 71 cents. And what I'll probably do is, I'll probably create something just so I could use those stickers. Like I'll bake a cherry something and <laughs> just so I could have those scrapbook pages uh, ready to go. So that's that one. Then I thought these were super cute, these little envelopes. They had them in white too, but I like the black ones and I thought just for my planner I could put like receipts in it, in my traveler's notebook or whatever. or you know, just some cards, or I could even attach it to um, like a card that I made and put like a Starbucks gift card in there or something on the inside. So I really like that, and it's dollar nineteen. And now I regret that I didn't buy the white ones with the gold inside because it's so much easier. I mean, I could make them myself, but why when I can get it for a dollar? Okay, next I got these little bows here. And they were already preformed and so cute. Uh, they're, of course, you know I love Fourth of July, and I have so many scrapbooks and things that I could be working on. And the, all that whole bag for only dollar seventy nine. I thought that was a great deal. Then there was this RG uh, Richard Gray. So I'd been wanting this for like the longest time, and I just so happened to be walking down the aisle, and, and at the very end of the end cap, there was like all these. Um, sale dies and stamp set and I'm like oh my gosh how cute for a masculine card or even for Christmas and it only came out to $5.39 and it used to be $24.99 so I thought that was so cute I wish that they had the lumberjack man I've always wanted that one too but I'm, it's okay I, I still love that so I'll show you some of the different projects I make using that and then last but not least I got this let me let me scoot it over here I got this um, die. I know it's probably because it's more of a summer thing, but look at how cute it is with the card, to make a card. And it's uh, Jen Long, and it's the cactus, and it's called Looking Sharp, and it opens up as a card. And it used to be $19.99, and it came out to $7.19. And I'm like, yes, I've been wanting that so bad. I thought that was so super duper cute. So those are all of my sale buys. Let me show you what else I got. Okay, so this tool here, it's a tech tool. I got it in like the drafting section of Hobby Lobby. And I've seen a lot of people use it to do lettering on the envelope, making sure their journaling is straight. And it's like that T-shaped ruler. And I like really, really wanted it. So I looked and looked and it was $3.99 and I used my 40% off coupon. So that was pretty cool. I'm working on a bunch of Halloween cards right now. So everything Halloween is 40% off at Hobby Lobby. So I had to get this paper pack and I thought it was super cute because I love when the packs are smaller dimensions. So for cards, you could actually see what the design is. So I'm excited to use that. And then if you don't know and you don't follow me on Instagram, you guys, I got the best blessing of my life. My husband surprised me with a brand new bulldog. You know that um, like almost two years ago we lost our bulldog trooper. I don't want to cry, so I'm going to go shortly here. But um, he passed away just a month short of being 10 years old. And since that day, I've been praying for another bulldog. And um, my husband surprised me, just brought him home. One day, um, just said, come outside, I have a surprise for you. And I got Bjorn. His name is Bjorn Ironside. If you're wondering about how I got his name, 
Um, it's from a TV show that I really like called Vikings on, I believe it's the History Channel. And um, I just love that name. It just sounds so rugged and rough. And <laughs> so anyways, I'll show a picture of you. And believe me, Bjorn is going to be in like probably every single one of my videos here forward, just like Trooper used to be. And in fact, he's snoring right here as I record this. So I'll show you what he looks like. He's so handsome, but this is in honor of him. And all the paper packs right now and all the paper kits are 50% off. So this was $4.50 because it was $9. And I'm gonna do a whole like page of pages or maybe even a little notebook of Bjorn Ironside. So it's so cute. That's kind of looks like him. Right there, my little Bjorn. Okay, let me show you what else I got. Okay, so a couple of weeks ago, or maybe a couple of months ago, my friend Michelle Hill surprised my friend Tina and I with um, some, she's a huge planner girl. I've talked about her before. And she gifted me this planner society, I guess it's like a traveler's notebook. And I love it, but I needed like something, you know, decorative on the front. So I got this at Hobby Lobby today. And it was, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna have to try to wipe that off. But it was $3.99 and it was 50% off. So I couldn't beat that. I thought it was so cute. Actually, no, I don't think it was $3.99. I mean, I don't think it was on sale. But $3.99 for this and it matches perfectly, I die. <laughs> and so there's my little, I'll show, would you like to see some of the pages I've been working on? I'll show you that too, but isn't that so cute? Okay, so kind of like going with that theme, uh, this is why I went to Hobby Lobby because I wanted some, I've been really working in my little traveler's notebook and I was gonna order some things on Etsy but I wasn't sure like if I'd really wanna do it so I thought I'd go to Hobby Lobby and try to buy some stuff first that you know, like I could get right now. And I went and oh my gosh, I did not realize that the Reset Girl sold at Hobby Lobby. In fact, I remember hearing that she was going to be there, but I never followed up on it. And so, oh my gosh, you guys, if you're into planning or, you know, if you don't really, I, I'm, I don't really shop online. I like to tangibly hold things. That's why I shop so much at each scrapbook expo because I love to hold it. But yeah, I got all these things to add to my traveler's notebooks. And they're all the reset girl. I, you know, I love my vintage. I was, I should have been born in the 50s. I love it. I want to dress like that every single day. <laughs> so I'm going to start off with these and I'm so excited. And all the planner stuff, you guys, was 30% off. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. So that's my Hobby Lobby haul. I had a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I actually have two scrapbook expo hauls to give you two. I will film those either today or tomorrow. So I love you guys and always remember, keep it crafty. Bye. Okay, if you're wondering what that noise is, it's my fan going on. I didn't realize it was gonna be that noisy. I'm so sorry, but here is Bjorn Ironside. I love him, you guys. He's like my heart. I'm so blessed by him. And here's my niece Paisley with me and we just love you and we hope you have a blessed day. Bye.